Hi guys, and welcome back to episode 83 of the Raid series. Now in the previous episode, we got the guide done. And after that, I uh, did a nighttime raid to get another kill for Insomnia. In this episode, uh, we'll work towards Insomnia and I also want to go through and figure out which items we are missing for the Kappa container uh, and so, or for the Kappa quest. So then we can uh, start farming those ones in the progress process of getting these nighttime kills. So without further ado, let's crack straight into it. For the typical uh, raid episode, we're going to go make sure we get enough fuel so we can have um, the do, 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 do. Bitcoin farm cranking. Um, I read everyone's comments from the previous episode. It was quite interesting. Some of the comments I saw just as I'm sorting this stuff out. Apparently, it was a bitch play what I did in labs. I actually think it was perfectly acceptable play. Fully sweaty chads running around labs. All I need to do is get enough XP to get out and um and continue with the guide quest but hey it's uh it's perfectly normal military tactic to shoot people and run and ambush people by setting traps so yeah i don't really care <laughs> you guys think what you want if you're doing the guide do it the way i did it don't bloody you don't have to be a hero and try and get 400 kills in a raid because some, some idiot on the internet says so. So, when you're trying to do the guide quest. Um, right, there's that. Now, <clears throat> something I want to take note of here is we're only two hours away from being in the not, the nighttime slot or insomnia. And so, when that hits, I'm going to go to labs for a couple of raids. I know we're not rolling in a lot of money right now, but... We have an extra graphics card sitting somewhere, do we? Is it found in raid? No. Nah. Right. I don't think we, we we can test it, I guess. Maybe one of these is found in raid. Not a quick um unload of it, but We don't need this. Get rid of that. Get rid of that. Get rid of that. Hell. Nah, I'll keep that. Right, that should be enough. Get rid of that site. I hate this site so much. Get rid of that. Alright, um. None. Not a single one. Oh, there is one. There's one that's found in raid. 49. Go to 48. Cool. And then we'll put the rest of these back in here. Yoink. Done. Cool, that's not that done. Now, um, I think we've got enough time for at least one factory raid night time. Would like to take a good helmet, but you know what? This is the blue, the blue one. Um, MP7 is a really good for factory. Don't know how many mags we've got for an MP7. Can't see any there. No, oh, it's one. FMJ is perfectly acceptable. 
APSX is the best. Um, that's stock. Is Cooper the salty FMJ? We just need some meds and we can jump in there. <clears throat> uh, seven. Right. For the chance of a ricochet. Dates. All right. Factory key. Got some stuff there. Let's just see what it looks like in there. Factory night time. I'm sure all. I'll get something back. Let's go. All right. Night time factory. We oh, fuck that was bright. What you trying to do the shotgun AP twenty kills at night time. Oops, hit the mouse. East 226. Worth a little bit. Right. Um... Didn't hear anyone else running around. The lighting is so bright with this MVJ. I can hear someone over here, I just don't know. What I'm looking out for here, if it's a player or a scav. So when someone's shooting a, like got a big bright light on like that, the best thing you can do is, um, Say that, that light's like illuminating from this spot. I literally just aim and just do little circles. Like I know it's not ideal, but I feel like that works quite often that you'll actually get, because they, they're giving you like a, a circle of, of where you can shoot at. So you pretty much just do circles of that area that they're shooting, like the, the big bright light's coming from. And that usually works quite well. So 
I don't know. It, it seems to work for me, so... Right. Got the one kill. Um, we'll keep doing Nighttime Factory and, and see if... Uh, until it gets to 2200, then we'll go labs. What I do want to check here is... If there's any items that we still need for the cabin container. So I might just bring up the EFT wiki collector. Um, I might just go through. I think we still need the fire steel. We definitely have the antique axe and the book. Hmm. Because we can get some of these in labs or other maps. So maybe we could just go to those other maps. So um, for example, let's see. That can go in to that. Got the 226. This usually does sell for a lot, but it's pretty late in the wipe now, so it's we're not worth much at all. Um, put that there for now. 20 will hold on to. All right, cool. So, quick look. Um, old fire steel. I don't think we have the fire steel. So that's RBAM. Uh, antique axe we've got in here. Battered book we have there. I clean gun lube we've got there. Rooster. Silver badge. We usually find them in, in uh, we usually find them pretty easily. All right, so silver badge, uh, safes and, and labs is also management off in particular. Did this on beard oil, we have that one. Uh, golden 1G phone. Yeah. 1G phone, we've got that. Devil Dog Mayo will be... Yep. Can of Sprats we've got there. Fake Mustache we've got down here. Cotton Beanie, got that. Lupos. Um, Lupos we've got here. Flag Mask. Shroud Shroud. Veritas guitar pick. And the blend 42. 40 second signature blend English tea from Sacral. So yeah, we just need the silver badge and the fire steel. So that's reserve RBAM. And Labs Management Office or Safe, really. Um, we can do customs nighttime for safes. RBAM we've got. Yeah, so it's not that not that time yet. So we'll just do nighttime factory. Yep, he's dead. Had a bad feeling about it. Check the safe for the uh, so uh, the sheriff Elo badges. Factory key. Really? Some's already extracted? 
There's going to be a bait here. Why they extracted? All right, another kill. Seventeen, thirteen to go. I'm sorry. Uh, I just saw something. Um, the, uh, yeah, we got the guy at the very start. I don't know. Someone else ran out straight away. So, uh, unfortunately, I didn't think there was any point sticking around. But this is actually kind of cool. We're actually seeing a few people in Nighttime Factory. So, um, I think we've got time probably to squish in one more. And then we can, um, we can squish in one more. And then we'll go to labs, I think. I might get that management office key for labs. We can try and get up, up top to get the, uh, the other stuff. So, um, drop that off. Reload this. We'll be able to sell that. So that 226 key actually sell for. Yeah. Uh, right. Um, I didn't sell the 226 key. Right, that's all that. Goes there. Yeah, one more. Let's go. Right, so we can get one more, one more, I think, non time factory in before we go labs. I think that will be the play. play. And, or maybe not time reserve. See how I feel. What was happening with my side? My gun was like, <laughs> no way, I would have had him. That was weird. I shot 22 rounds, only two bullets hit him. Cause like my, my gun was going like that. Oh my God, that's so stupid. <laughs> that was so lame. That is completely lame. Oh. Oh, those things happen. Welcome to Tarkov. My God. I think what's happened was I lean, was leaning or where I was leaning, it made the door like clip into me. And because the door was clipped into me, it was like making the gun go like rid ridiculous. But look, these things happen. I had that guy. He was so I caught out of place. He was stuck out in the open. Nowhere to run. Oh, well, these things happen. We just deal with it. We move on. All right, um, this can now be nighttime factory, a uh, nighttime, uh, nighttime labs. I, pff, this is gonna be, it's gonna be reckless. I think P90 is the way to go for this map. Um, we've got a P90 sitting around. Do, 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 do. Should be able to get one of the good ones, pretty cheap.
Then we just got to get the mags for it, which I think we should have a few. Well, like three more. Well, that's all the ammo we got, so what we're using. I actually kind of want to go factory because of the fact that there's so many people in there right now. Oh, they took the suppressor off. Oh, well. That's actually the most popping I've seen it in a while. But I'll do one lab's run, see how we go. Now, I need management office key. And I'm tap. I think we've got one back in insurance. All right, let's see how this goes. I'm, I'm not going to be hopeful. I'm going to be hopeful, but expecting failure. So the, because the left-hand side says 2200, it means that labs will be 2200. So it means that it will count towards our nighttime kills. Right, we're in. We are on the prowl for PMC, so... Hopefully we can get something cool happening. All right, the fire still spawns down here, so we can try and get that. It wasn't there. And that um, management office can have the ELO badge, so this is ris risky as fuck. There's two. One's up there. Wait, was it? That is someone else? I put myself in a really bad position. I should have pre-meded before jumping off. I actually got clipped when I was in the, in the air, so... Um, look, they shot like a gazillion rounds to kill me. <laughs> the reason why I kept I, I start, decided to move off was the fact that they were trying to like, pincer me around by going around the uh, outside. And there was a spot I could have gone that would have prevented that. But... Yeah, I don't know. Labs is a bit weird right now. Like, just super mega chads. And, uh... It's not that I don't have the cash flow to do it. Like, we do have a bit of money up our sleeve. It's just... Two bad ra raids in a row, or three bad raids in a row, if I go fully geared into labs. And we are, like, really poor. And I, I don't, like... I don't want to promote just doing that. Even though it might be more enjoyable to watch me go into labs fully geared. I personally don't want to really do that um, because if you're in your, my situation with 3 million rubles, you shouldn't really be going into labs, particularly fully geared. Um, if we, if, if the Bitcoin farm was still cranking as much money as it used to, it might be a bit of a different story, but um, yeah. I don't know. I, I don't know where I really sit with it at the moment. All right, we do have the Vector 45, we've got an M1A. We do have a bit of stuff. Let's go, let's go Vector 9 mil. Nighttime factory is popping at the moment, so I kind of keen to get in there. Um, we'll take the slick and that. We can either, um, we should buy them because we've got so much US dollars at the moment. Ooh. 
And we don't need the face shield because it's nighttime factory. We need the need the sword and before. There's that. Turn that on. One. That should be enough. Let's see what ammo we've got. Oh, that's plenty of ammo for a nighttime factory run. And get rid of that. Put a factory key in. Actually, I want to do reserve. I want to do reserve. Try and get the RBAM. Then I need to make a decision how I want to get the um the other one. So reserve. Go reserve nighttime. And I just want some propitals. See if we can taste down some fights at the same time. We have. I'm, I'm lost at the moment. 13 to go. We also do need a lot of stress resistance, so getting in fights isn't the worst thing. So, reserve, night time. We'll give it some insurance. Better no insure that. Let's go. <laughs> right, night time reserve. We're going to go for the uh, RBAM room. Which we've already got the key for, and then that should hopefully get us a fire steel. So it's actually a good room to get nighttime kills because it's the drop down room as well. There's a Mosin shot over there too. It's underneath the drop down room, I'm meant to say. Someone I just saw. Back here is where it spawns. Right, it's not here this time. What I'm going to do... I think this removes a lot of the glare from... Will that be okay? I do. I want to try and find this guy with the Mosin. Someone to stand still. It could be up at that tower, but hmm. Mom, where did he go? Oh, 
I'm going to go underneath because that's generally where a lot of the action goes. I'm going to hunt down some players under here. I heard two. I don't know if they went up or, or I should be expecting them to go Down here. I'm going to go with my gut instinct and think D2. Doors open, so someone's been here. Someone's been through both doors. That actually probably came, came. I reckon they came from the dome side. So hard to see with the blur out lights. Hmm. Do I reset? I'm, le I'm leaning towards resetting. If I reset, I don't have time for another reserve raid. He went up in the king, and I don't know if... He could be anywhere by now. Let's reset. We'll do an all-time factory. I think that... I think it has to be the play. To be honest. Because I could run all the way back up there, try and find him, and he could just be hiding in a corner somewhere. Doesn't really, doesn't really work. So, 
And I don't know where that Mosin guy went either. I don't want a hard W key straight towards enemies, but if I, the priorities go for the fire steal and then go for the enemies, but um, yeah, it's interesting that. Right. We're not in any rush, but I just want to do it correctly. All right, so we drop that off. That off, and, and that's good barter trade. And leave that there. I'm going to put my factory key down. Okay, cool. And we'll jump into another factory. No time. Let's go. I don't know what's up with my ping for this raid, but there's a good chance I'm going to get booted. It's jumping around a lot. Like, it's gone from, like, 140 or lot to 180. It's not cool. Network's not doing anything. I wish I had a grenade right now. There's two. Sounds like there's two. I want to get up on top of this. I'm... That's the pin kick. Oh, man. Two in there. See if I can rejoin. I don't know why the pings jump from like 130 to 180. I reckon I'll be dead before I get back in. So I would have cleared in that area and I was kind of and we're a little bit open. There's two options. If we do get back in, I just W key charge and try and get a kill or I just run for the extract and just get out with the gear. I'm 
ping stay low enough. Fuck it, I'm just gonna go. I'm worried about this pin kick. I could have extracted just then. I think they extracted. Socks. Sorry, guys. I don't know. I'll check the service, but something's gone wrong with that server. That was not on my end. Run through two. <laughs> These things happen. Um, it sounds like that server was shit in the bed. All right. So, unfortunately, it wasn't the most eventful episode. Um, we've got a couple of kills for insomnia, and I tried to get uh, the. I tried to get the RBAM, but it is what it is. So um, we'll go back and do another reserve raid on the next episode and then and uh, try and take advantage of this night time. Oh, I also did the labs raid, which got smacked on. Um, yeah, no idea what's going on with that server. So I'll go check the server list, make sure that's no longer in the server list. Um, just because I feel like shit in the bed. Whatever server I have, that's like the 100 pings on the server. Um, but anyway. As for this episode, guys, that is it, unfortunately. We only got the, uh, like I said, the two kills, but we did, I suppose, level up dress resistance a little bit. Every time I go into a nighttime factory raid or a raid, I really just need to, like, break my legs just before I leave, just to get those last 20 points. Um, otherwise, it could be a while, but not much to go, really. Um, got to get one more level in stress resistance, 13 more nighttime kills, find two items for the collector, and one headshot, and we're good. So, um, guys, like I said, that is it. So make sure you usual drill, like, comment for the YouTube algorithm, subscribe, notification bell if you haven't already. Um, I'm going to get into another episode now. So, um, lastly, guys, I'll see you next time.